Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to choose the right color on foundation because I know it's difficult to find the perfect match. Sometimes we end up with a foundation that makes our face look like, I don't know, lighter and darker than our body, right? <laughs> so if you wanna know how to choose your foundation, keep on watching and let's get started. Okay, so first we go to a store to get a foundation and we see one and think, oh, I think this one matches my skin tone. <laughs> so I'm here with my foundation. This one is from Shigla and my shade is Wheat, by the way. And uh, generally the size woman or even you put just a small amount like this. <laughs> <laughs> and spread it all over our face, right? Don't lie to me. <laughs> I know you do that. I still see some people testing the foundation on their forearm to see the color, but guys, this is no sense. <laughs> I mean, this is an area that doesn't get sun exposure. And also we want to apply foundation on our forearm, right? <laughs> so the right place to test it is on our face. So with that being said, let's apply our foundation. Remember to use a good amount to see the color on our face, okay? And here's the most important thing to see if the color matches our skin tone. Some people have a lighter face than their bodies due to using sunscreen and such. So I'm gonna apply it on my jaw because I can compare both with my neck and face. So I apply it just a small amount. I tap it with my finger a little bit. And just that. You can apply it on your forehead as well. As we usually have a darkened forehead, do more sun exposure. And also on your shoulder. Why, guys? First, let me wipe my finger. So I'm wearing white, so it's dangerous. <laughs> Remember what I said about the face being lighter than the body? So when I apply it on my shoulder, I make sure that the foundation matches with my body skin tone as well. If I only pay attention to my face and my face is lighter than my body, it'll give the impression that my foundation is the wrong shade. So maybe now you guys can see better. Uh, look how the foundation looks lighter on my forehead because as I said, my forehead gets more sun exposure. All my jaw practically disappeared into my skin so the foundation matches perfectly. And on my shoulder, it looks a bit orange, but that's because the undertone. I can bring another video talking about foundations undertone because it's really important too. So let me know in the comments and also subscribe to this channel. <laughs> this feedback is really important to your sister here, okay? So I can say that I found my tone, uh, except for the undertone, but I found the right foundation tone, okay? Uh, it's light in here, but I do contour in this area, so it's okay. The point is the foundation has to match with your body. So using a good amount and applying it in the right place is key, okay? So I do just a basic makeup to finish this video and I'll be back soon. And that's it, guys. Let me know in the comments if these tips made a difference for you. By the way, are you put two videos on the screen if you want to watch more, okay? So that's all. Bye-bye.